to a study um, that focuses on the, the South neighborhood at uh, Gallery Park City. The South neighborhood um, was developed as the first phase of Battery Park City starting in 1980 and was constructed in accordance with the, with the master plan and the design guidelines. Over time, um, in the 35 years that have elapsed since the development of the South neighborhood, there have been, of course, um, a, a great number of changes um, to the neighborhood. Um, we have uh, completed our evaluation process and recommend that Stantec be awarded the contract for the project in the amount of $247,514. This uh, project for the public spaces you just moved right now is not capable at all? Um, no, um, they were not ruled out as not, uh, not capable, but the uh, conclusion was that there were certain elements of the um, that, that were considered important to the evaluation that they did not present the proper capabilities to no, So then the totality of the requirements you deem them to be unqualified. True or false? Yes. Less qualified. Less qualified. Well, it's got to be significantly less since it's $113,000 or some 45 to 48% spread. False. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Tech is your second highest for six million. This is an urban planning task, correct? Urban planning, economic, that is, there's an economic component to this, there's a regulatory assessment component. Those were the areas where we felt the project was. Well, because that led the criteria that went 40%, 25, 25, 10. Uh, there's nothing there about money. Well, Right, because the because the technical. I, I understand. Right. I understand. Right. So that's fine. I get that. Um, let me ask a question. So, for an urban planning exercise, you're, you're, you're assuming whoever you hire, they're they're going to turn their work over to engineers ultimately. Right. Who are going to do the technical right. design? Right. Correct. So, I mean, look, I don't want to question the, how you set up your criteria. But you know, certain levels of expertise in plant material is really going to be left down the road to the landscape architect who's ultimately going to. Right. So, you know, I just and by the way, also I'm not I'm not 100 percent certain I understand what locations these are. Is there? Can we look at the map down there and see where we're talking about? Yeah. Yeah. So, if we start, <coughs> if we start here, it south of Dudley, it's, it's the area of the other side of, of South and Dudley, including this the street bed, all the way down to the cul de sac here, and then West 10th Street from here to West Street. So, close from Liberty? Yes. Okay. So, all the way down. Yes. Yep. So this is going to be street furniture with new it'll, hardscape or accommodate landscaping. It'll be. It'll, it also. It also evaluates there. There are some significant issues that are created by the fact that by the fact that the street is as wide as it is. Mm -hmm. um, that creates issues for pedestrians. It all. There are also issues related to loading and unloading, which if you ever notice when you're coming to this building, sometimes. The, the, the area is just just a mass with 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 with, uh, with trucks in the middle of the street, the side of the street, everywhere. Um, and also, you, you've got these um, arcades that are on the west side of the, the street, which were originally part of the master plan and the, the, the guidelines, design guidelines. However, it is meaning a further setback from the side yes, of the Yes, it's got the covered setback. Which, which uh, really tends to stifle um, the retail um, presence and activity along Listen, there. The buildings are extended, the residential portion extends out over the right. yeah. And so visibility for, for retail activity is, is very limited. Um, it's, it's something that you know, we have.
kind of back to the point. Yeah, about a month. Yeah. Um, it is the conclusion of the staff. This is a question. It's the conclusion of the staff that this hundred thirty-five thousand dollar bid um, is made by an organization that, one way or another, will not be able to handle the project to the satisfaction of the public. <coughs> right. So we'll dismiss that. Now we've got another seventy-three point guy at two hundred thousand, so we'll dismiss him. Two twenty-eight to two forty-seven. Is a guy lower three hundred I, I believe it's fair to say that that the top two um, Stantec Rogers Partners were the only two that that satisfied all you of the components. You felt fully comfortable. With yes. Okay. All right. Well, that's my question. May I? And, uh, so. Assuming that they're going to, I mean, in a very radical suggestion, they're going to do something with those arcades that's potentially going to increase the value or even the size of the retail. So that's a possibility, right? Well, we're, we're looking at possible options. Of course, there are a lot of stakeholders here, being the, they're the building owners. Well, exactly. The, 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 the More than stakeholders. They, are, right. they, will, they may have a direct benefit oh, from what we're doing. Absolutely. Right? So are they, are, are they engaged in this process? That's, that's, that part, of, that's part of the scope. I The understanding, I guess, that if we increase their value through this function, somehow that comes back to us. Are they contributing dollars or just uh, input? No, at, at this input point, at, at this point, yeah, we, yeah. we did. We have engaged yeah. these right. guys that right. we have right. hired right. are right. going right. to manage the engagement with our right. 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 And certainly right. hearing right. from the stakeholders is the key part of this, and sure. it's highlighted in the sure. RFP. Okay. All right, what else? Uh, just one question. When in terms of the final evaluation score, is that exclusive of the cost? Yes. So yes. that's the evaluation of that's the right. cost. That's right. And what, what percent did you put a weight on cost? Well, the, the, way that, the way that we evaluate cost um, is we open the, the cost proposal after the technical evaluation. We look at the cost and we, and we, um, we look at the, the cost proposal for the highest rated firm. And, and we compare them um, to the other costs and, and say, does that, given the, the, the needs of the project, does that represent a fair and reasonable cost? And does that give us the best value, the, the best bang for our buck? Um, as the authority. Now, that it would, if we have two or three proposers that are very close, we, we figure that they're all three capable of doing the work um, and the scores are close, and the third high technical score is a lot less expensive but fully capable of doing the work. Then we would you take, would go, yes, we okay. would flip that one. So top. looking at this, you would say that uh, Stantec had a higher technical score. Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> I didn't know if price came in to, no, no. at that point, no, no. or after. Not at that point. Yeah. All right, do we have a motion? So moved. Moved by Ms. Gallup. Second. Second by Ms. Gallup. In favor? Aye. There is no opposition. Motion is passed. All right.